The highly anticipated 10th anniversary celebration of the Invictus Games, a Paralympic-style sporting event for wounded veterans championed by Prince Harry, has been overshadowed by a brewing controversy. Dozens of veterans who have participated in past Invictus Games have reportedly chosen to forego this year's event, citing Prince Harry and his wife Meghan Markle's attendance as a primary reason for their absence. This news comes amidst a growing public perception of Prince Harry as increasingly out of touch with the core mission of the Invictus Games. Many veterans who have benefited from the Games express a sense of disillusionment with the Duke of Sussex, who they believe has allowed his royal title and Hollywood connections to overshadow the original purpose of the event to empower and inspire those who have served their countries. The discontent amongst veterans stems from several factors. Firstly, there is a deep unease surrounding the lavish, celebrity-studded nature of the 10th anniversary celebration. Veterans who have competed in past games reminisce about a simpler, more focused environment where the emphasis was on camaraderie, support, and athletic achievement. The extravagant nature of this year's event, some argue, feels incongruous with the core values of the Invictus Games. Secondly, there is a concern that Prince Harry's involvement with Netflix and other commercial ventures has compromised the integrity of the Games. Several veterans expressed a sense of exploitation, fearing that the event is being used as a platform to bolster Prince Harry's public image rather than genuinely supporting the veteran community. Thirdly, and perhaps most importantly, there is a deep disappointment with Prince Harry's perceived lack of understanding of the challenges faced by many veterans. His decision to step back from his royal duties and relocate to California has been interpreted by some as a retreat from the very community he once championed. Veterans point out the vast disconnect between their daily struggles and the privileged life Prince Harry now leads. It is important to note that not all veterans share this critical perspective. Many remain staunch supporters of Prince Harry and his vision for the Invictus Games. They credit the Games with transforming their lives and fostering a strong sense of community amongst veterans. However, the growing dissent from a significant portion of the veteran community cannot be ignored. It serves as a stark reminder of the need to maintain the core values of the Invictus Games, values that many believe have been compromised in the pursuit of celebrity and grandeur. The upcoming 10th anniversary celebration presents a critical juncture for the Invictus Games. The event has the potential to reignite the spirit of camaraderie and support that first inspired the Games. However, to achieve this Prince Harry may need to acknowledge the concerns of the veterans he seeks to represent. A return to the core principles of the Games a focus on veterans' well-being, a celebration of athletic achievement, and a commitment to service, may be the only way to win back the trust of those who have served their